It's Joe Hansel here with a national severe weather threats for you on this Wednesday. Watching for snow where areas of the nation are never quite ready for it. Let's zoom right in towards Dallas. We have areas of snow already reporting this morning as far south as El Paso, Texas. Watching for heavy snow and freezing rain accumulation down south today. Severe weather possible in the southeast. Heavy showers in areas of the intermountain west continue as well. Severe weather, marginal to slight risk in the deep south. Uh, watching for large hail, damaging winds, and a few tornadoes potentially later today. Thursday, that uh, potential progresses eastward and enhances a little bit. Enhanced risk of severe storms cutting into areas of Florida, Georgia, and South Carolina. Rainfall could see about two inches through Friday evening into the New Orleans area. Two to four inches, locally up to a half a foot in areas of the southeast will prompt flooding concerns in areas of the southeast. Seattle also watching for potentially some localized flooding west of the Cascade Mountains. Over an inch of rain is possible near the Seattle area. A lot of winter concerns in the Intermountain West and we have winter storm watches, winter weather advisories, winter storm warnings from Maine to El Paso, about 1500 or more miles of a swath of this two to six inches of snow generally with locally heavier amounts in some areas and also the mountains where we're expecting 10 to 18 inches, locally two feet in the mountains, the lower elevations, maybe around a foot in Jackson Hole, Wyoming. Thursday, Salt Lake City and Denver could see a couple or a few inches of snow. And speaking of where we're never quite ready for the snow, here is the southwest. You have to be safe driving. Um, just take it slow. Don't travel if you can help it. A few inches possible in Lubbock and Oklahoma City with some freezing rain accumulation. Also some snow in Chicago, Detroit later in the day today and tomorrow. Could see close to double digit snowfall totals in spots like Burlington and Caribou, Maine. So again, areas of Texas, Oklahoma, it is going to be very hazardous traveling. You got to be safe. Expecting a lot of car accidents. Don't be one through the day today before snow wraps up for you tomorrow.